Welcome to Canva and this is my recipe, caramel slices. Once you're in Canva, click on create a design. Then in the search box, type flyer, F-L-Y-E-R, and press return. So on the left, you have all your tools. Search for uploads and click on uploads. This is where you are going to put all of your images. I have copied all of my images to the desktop. So now I can drag and drop my images straight into where the images are on the uploads. Now you can take your time and transfer all your photos or your text from the desktop to the uploads folder in Canva. I'm going to make this go a little quicker, so I'm going to speed up the film a little. And now I can start dragging and dropping my images from my uploads folder in Canva onto my work area. Likewise, when I have dragged and dropped my images, I can resize the images to the size that I want. I can add text by either selecting the preset text, the headings, or I can create my own text and change the sizes. I can also collect shapes and can use them to make outlines or borders. We can also set the shapes to go forwards or backwards so that we can see, for example, text in front of the box or if we want the box to go behind the text, this is all possible. And we can also change the colour of the boxes if, if, we, if we want to. Don't think I like that colour very much. Try again. So now I'll start adding some more images to, uh, to my page. And as before, you can see, uh, I can move these images wherever I want to. And again, I'll fast forward here. All these images I imported from uh, other places on the internet. So these images come from websites. Uh, all I did was to copy the images and place the images where I wanted to. I'm going to write uh, the main text for my recipe. So the recipe that I found, for you it will be the recipe that you've learned from either your mother, your father, your grandfather. So when you've found your recipe, this is what you're going to do. You're going to start writing the ingredients, as we have already done, uh, and then finally start writing the method. I've put two columns, one next to the other. Now just watch this, this is really whiz. I can type really really fast, watch this.
So now I'm going to just copy and paste this text and then I'm going to start writing my method. Be careful, uh, you will have to write sentences in this section. So now I'm just adding final touches just to make my presentation look uh, more professional. And as you can see, uh, it's starting to look uh, kind of finished. So now that I've finished, going to share my design. I'm going to save it as a PDF file. So I'm basically going to click on the download arrow, PDF print, and then download and just be patient and uh, wait for uh, the design to be finished. Click on Authorize Downloads or Allow Downloads. So this is my final recipe. Uh, I'm quite happy with this actually, it looks quite nice. It looks delicious. So finally we've come to the end. Uh, you have to share this recipe with a friend, uh, with a school friend. Uh, so send it via the share button on the top. Uh, if you don't have anybody to share it with, you can share it with me. Uh, so please share it with me you, or you can send it um, via email to me uh, when it's finally finished. Thank you for listening and see you soon.